Hi again then guys, and so we've got another Gran Turismo 6 top speed tune for you today. And this time it's for the Fiat Coupe Turbo Plus. So you want your racing soft tyres of course. For your suspension we've got the ride height on 90, front and rear. Springs we've increased up to 575 and 5. Dampers to 4, anti-roll to 6. Camber quite high for this one on 3 to stop the car from weaving all over the road at high speed. Neutral tow as usual. For the gearbox, we've got an auto setting of 180. Then for the individual gear gears, we've got 3.4, 2.3, 1725, 1350, 1100 and 900 with a final drive of 2.4. For the diff, we've got 30 on torque, acceleration and deceleration. All the power upgrades, of course. And as always, I would, of course, recommend having NOS and obviously your full weight OS package. Traction control is of course turned off as usual. And so in real life the Fiat Coupe is a very popular choice as a front wheel drive drag car. Interestingly, quite a few people build Fiat Coupe drag cars. On the game, not so much. You don't see that many people using the Fiat Coupe, which is kind of a shame because for a front drive car it's pretty good. Now it's not the fastest of front wheel drive cars quite far off being the fastest but it is still fast it has a top speed or cruising speed i should say on its own of around 214 which is pretty decent for its power and pretty decent for a fiat as well and as far as draft potential as you can see you're a fair way away from the red line around a thousand rpm give or take so it's not so much of a draft tune as some of my others you should be able to quite easily draft it to up around probably 220, 230, that kind of speed, maybe a little bit more. So if you do plan on using this car for extremely high speed drafting, say 270 or 280 or more, which it does have the potential to do, then you'll want to extend your final drive a bit more. But obviously that will affect your cruising speed because you can't really have both with this car. So overall, the performance is not exactly record-breaking, like I said, but pretty decent for a Fiat and pretty decent for a front-wheel drive car. And the acceleration, especially mid-range, is among the quicker models of the front-wheel drive range. Overall, it's kind of an underappreciated car. It's not amazing, per se, but it's pretty good, and it is certainly underappreciated. And overall, it's probably the strongest Fiat in the game for performance, not too surprisingly. The bar chat is okay, but this car is stronger overall. So, if you decide to use this tune, obviously I hope you find it helpful and of course competitive, and if you're new to the channel or just found this helpful in general, feel free to subscribe. I put out new top speed tunes like this and faster than this every day, new drag tunes on the weekends, various other tunes in the week, and as always, thanks for watching. Thank you.